couple months ago, I made a YouTube video and I titled it basically my three worst investments that I have done. And one of those stocks was AST Space Mobile Incorporated, ticker ASTS. And I said it was one of the investments that I regret because one, I didn't research it enough. And two, it was a very risky play. It's one of those stocks that, that is either going to do very well or go to zero. And you might be saying, well, that's all stocks, but this one has a very good chance of going to zero. I bought a bunch of this company at $10 a share and, you know, it went down to around $3 a share at one point. So again, it was a very bad investment for me. That said, this year has been very good for the actual, not only just the stock, but the company itself. At time of recording, AST, ASTS is trading at $9.32 a share. That's obviously, you know, up dramatically from where it was at the beginning of the year. And there's two big reasons for that. One of them is AT&T, and one of them is Verizon. See, ASTS is attempting to launch satellites in space for broadband technology for mobile phones. And they have struck deals with both AT&T and Verizon, where they basically maximizing coverage for them. The, the goal of ASTS is basically to not have, basically make it where there's no dead spots on the planet for cellular reception. And that's why the company is so interesting because that is a huge goal and a very important goal. And if they succeed in doing that, that's a very profitable goal. And they're gonna be launching more satellites and this deal that they have gotten with Verizon and AT&T is huge for them, like it's huge for them. It verifies the business, it gives them revenue to work with, and, you know, this is huge news. But, that being said, AST Space Mobile, Space Mobile Incorporated still has a lot of problems as well. They are losing a ton of money because what they want to do, while it will become very profitable if they're able to succeed, it's very expensive. And even this new revenue that they have created from AT&T and Verizon is still not enough to overcome how much money they're actually losing. The company's a startup, it's a very new company. Obviously, I don't expect them to be profitable yet, but that being said, they are losing a good amount of money, and to raise that money that they're spending, you know, obviously as a shareholder, you're getting diluted. So with that in mind, I very much like this company, I very much am hoping for them to succeed, and even though I'm about to break even on the stock that I was down on dramatically, I'm actually not planning to really sell any shares of the company. But I'm also not really planning to buy any more shares either, just because I do view this investment as very risky. And even though I definitely want to be, you know, part of this company and I definitely want to take advantage of the company's technology does work and they do achieve their goals. That said, I'm also not planning to risk any more capital either. But again, super happy at what AST Space Mobile Incorporated is doing this year. You know, I hope that continues. I hope they're able to, you know, launch more satellites, grow the network more, and I hope they achieve everything they're setting out to do. It's absolutely impressive. And yeah, it's been very awesome to see how much the stock has actually improved this year compared to how it was the last couple of years. Thank you so much for listening to this video. Make sure to subscribe to the channel. Thank you for watching.